Hello everyone and welcome to my dumbbell full body workout for over 50. My name is Anthony and welcome to 4x4 Circuits. Welcome to the workout. I hope everybody's having a fantastic day so far. So with this workout, you will need a set of weights. However, if you don't have access to a set of weights, fill up two water bottles and that will be absolutely fine. With that said, let's begin this dumbbell workout with a warm up, with a march in three and two and one. Let's go, let's lift those knees. Keep a nice strong core and let's get those arms pumping. Fantastic stuff. So how today's workout is going to work? We've got eight exercises to four rounds. Spending 30 seconds on each exercise, followed by a 15 seconds rest. In that 15 seconds rest period, I will demonstrate the next exercise. And at the end of the workout, we're going to do a full body cool down stretch standing up. Lovely job. Okay, let's increase the pace of this march in three and two and one. Let's go. Let's get the blood flowing. Keep a strong core, chest out, straight back, face towards me, looking good. Okay, in five seconds time, we're going to get a step jacks in five, four, three, two, one. Step it out to the side, arms come parallel to the ground, looking good, fantastic. You want to keep it low impact, but make it a little bit more challenging. Take the hands above the head, add in a clap. Nicely done, that is perfect. Okay, in five seconds time, we're going to come back to our march and we're going to throw some light punches out in front of us. There's five, four, three, two, and one. Back to our march, light punches out in front. Try and keep the arms and chest high and try not to overextend the elbows. Now you can do this walking forwards and walking backwards at the same time. Let's take it to the ground. Fantastic, well done. Good effort, keep that going, push them out to the side. Looking good, awesome stuff, feeding the energy. Feeling nice and positive. Let's go above, nicely done. Okay, we're gonna go through it one more time. Throw those punches out in front. Nice, good stuff, well done. Down to the ground we go. Fantastic, good. Let's push them out to the sides. Excellent work. And finish off up above, hold it there. There's five, four, three, two, one. Lovely job. Okay, feet now shoulder width apart, toes facing forward. Bring the arms up to chest height, interlocking the fingers like so, slowly rotate one continuous movement side to side, face towards where you're rotating, keep the tummy sucked in, nice strong core, we are activating those oblique muscles, lovely job, that's perfect. Okay, let's extend the arm through, try and keep the arm at chest height, pushing through that rotation, again follow that round with the head, lovely job. Okay, let's reach up to the ceiling, Nice, good stuff. Coming back to middle way in five. There's four, and three, and two. Last one, perfect. Keeping the feet shoulder width apart. I'm gonna demonstrate side on. We're gonna warm up the legs. We're gonna go down for a squat. So what we're gonna do is sit back into the squat, keep a nice strong core, weight on the heels, and push up through the legs, standing nice and tall, chest out, squeeze the glutes. Now, if you can't go down all the way, try halfway. If not, a quarter way will be absolutely fine. You go down as far as you feel comfortable. Lovely job, good. So once again, sitting back into the squat, weight on the heels, and we're gonna push up through the legs. Let's do two more together. Fantastic, one last one. Nicely done, good effort. Standing nice and tall. We're going to take the right leg back into a lunge. We're going to keep that body upright, head up facing forwards, push off the front leg, come up and change over. Now again, you go down as far as you feel comfortable. So if you can only go down halfway, that's fine. Again, the same with a quarter weight as well. These exercises 
are in the workout. So you can do halfways and quarters in there. Also as well, nicely done. Keep a nice strong core facing forwards. Take your time stepping back, focus on the balance. Let's step back one more time. Nicely done, perfect. Now we're gonna finish off with some arm circles. Take it up nice and high, and we're gonna go backwards. Lovely job warming up the shoulders. Fantastic work, good effort. Okay, let's change directions up and over. Nicely done, good. Coming back to middle in five, there's four, three, two, one. Awesome stuff. That's the warm up completed. Grab yourself a drink of water. I'm going to demonstrate the first exercise. But first, I'm going to demonstrate how to pick up the dumbbells, just in case anybody has forgotten. So, what we do is have feet shoulder width apart, dumbbells either side of the feet, sit back into the squat, weight on the heels, take the dumbbells, push up through the legs, stand tall. Now if you can't get down that far, pop the dumbbells on something elevated and that'll be absolutely fine. So the first exercise we do is a squat to shoulder press. Now you can do the full squat, half squat, or a quarter of a squat. Whatever you feel comfortable with, that's what we're gonna do. So I'm gonna demonstrate the full squat. So sit back into the squat, push up through the legs, and extend the weights up. So sit back down, stand up, and extend the weights up. Now you can do that doing a quarter squat and a half squat. It's whatever feels comfortable for you. I'm gonna start the timer, well off in 10 seconds. Let's get ready to go. We have a nice fun workout. Each repetition we're gonna do nice and slow and controlled. Let's get ready, three, two, one. Squat down, extend up. Sitting back into the squat, weight on the heels, push up through the legs, standing nice and tall. Good stuff, well done. Keep a nice strong core, head up facing forwards. Lovely job. And try not to overextend the elbows. Good start. Keep that going, couple more repetitions. Down we go. Push up through. Three, two, one. Nicely done. Next one we do is weighted side bends. Feet shoulder width apart. Go down, squeeze the obliques, and back over the other side. Let's get ready in three. Two, one, down we go, hand to the knee, back up and slowly down the other side, one continuous movement. Take your time and really focus on the muscles that you're working. So we're working those oblique muscles in the side. So we're really gonna focus on those, really visualize them. Nicely done, keep that going, 10 seconds to go. Fantastic stuff, well done, keep it up. Okay, three. Two, one, nicely done. Palms facing in, so we've got knuckles facing out. Go lead up with the elbows, weight underneath the chin, squeeze at the top, and slowly release. Let's get ready in three, two, one. Here we go. Just up nice and slowly, and slowly down. So we go up, one, two, down, one, two. We breathe out as we come to the top. And breathe in, breathe out, and breathe in. Good stuff. Keep that strong core going, head facing forwards, looking good. Excellent stuff. Okay, three, two, one. Nicely done. Next one's going to be the hammer curl. Right hand across the left chest, and then we've got left hand across to the right chest, squeezing the bicep as we come up. Let's get ready to go in three. Two, one, here we go, up and squeeze. Nicely done, perfect. Let's keep that going. So up, one, two, down, one, two. Up, one, two, down, one, two. And don't forget just to take your time with each repetition. With weights, the slower, the better. You don't want any fast pace in it whatsoever. Good stuff, four, three, two, one. The next one is gonna be the reverse lunge like we did in the warm up, but we're gonna add in a bicep curl, just like that, come up and change over. Now you can do this, go down halfway or quarter as well. Three, 
two, one, let's go. Squeeze those biceps. Good stuff, working the legs, keeping the head up facing forwards. Keep a nice strong core. Lovely job, take your time stepping backwards. Focus on balance. Nice, good stuff. Well done everyone, keep it up. Excellent work. That's perfect, good, keep it going. Lovely job, three, two, one, perfect. The next one's gonna be a front to side raise. Feet shoulder width apart, weights up in front, to the side, and back down. Let's get ready, three, two, one, here we go. Just like that, so arms come parallel to the ground, keep it parallel to the side, and drop it down nice and slow. Now if you struggle with that, you can alternate, just do one at a time, go up and down just like that. Good stuff, keep that going. Fantastic work. 10 seconds to go, looking good. Keeping that tummy sucked in for that strong core. Excellent, three, two, one. Nicely done. Next one, feet shoulder width apart. Gonna stick the bum out a bit, keep a nice strong core, knees slightly bent. Arms down, lead up with the elbows, squeeze, and slowly release. Three, two, one, here we go. Good stuff, just like that. Bent over row, come up and squeeze, slowly release, good job. Keep the head facing down with a nice strong core. Excellent. Good, you control the weights, don't let the weights control you. Fantastic, well done everyone, keep it going. A good positive start to round number one, awesome. Three, two, one, excellent stuff. The next one we do is calf raises. So weights by the side, feet shoulder width apart. Gonna come up on the toes and slowly down. So we come up on the toes and down. Let's get ready, off we go. Keep the head up facing forwards. Come up and squeeze those calves, slowly back down. Come up and squeeze, slowly back down, just like that, well done. Keep that going, fantastic job. Focus on each repetition. Excellent, good, up and squeeze, slowly back down, okay. Three, two, one, fantastic stuff. Round one completed, well done for getting through that everybody. Now we're going to go in round two, back to the squat. Sitting back into the squat, push up through the legs and extending the arms up. Let's get ready. In three, two, one, round two, underway. Push it up, slowly down. Good stuff, push it up. Slowly down, good, nice. Just like that. So don't forget, we're sitting back into the squat, weight on the heel, strong core, head up, face and forwards. Good, take your time. Good, slow and quality, good reps. Nice, keep that going. Three, two, one, perfect stuff. The next one, feet shoulder width apart, palms facing in, hands down to the knee, squeeze, up and back over, the same procedure. Let's get ready, three, two, one. Down we go, squeeze, up and over, down and squeeze, good stuff. So we're working the core and the obliques. We're just taking our time. Excellent, keeping the spine neutral, keep a nice straight back. Excellent stuff, head facing forwards. Again, we're working with the tummy sucked in as always. Nicely done, good stuff. Okay, three, two, one, perfect stuff. Okay, palms facing in, knuckles facing out. Lean up with the elbows, weights underneath the chin, up and squeeze, and slowly back down. Let's get ready in four, three, two, one. Here we go. Just like that, nicely done, good. Come up and squeeze, slowly back down. Up, one, two, down, one, two. Up, one, two. Down, one, two, perfect. Let's do the breathing. Breathe out, breathe in. Here we go again, breathe out, and breathe in. Good stuff, three, two, 
one, nicely done. The next one, the hammer curls. Right arm, cross the left chest. Left arm, cross the right chest. Squeezing those biceps. Let's get ready off in four, three, two, one. Here we go, up and squeeze. Fantastic job. Keep that going, keep it nice and slow and controlled. You're doing a great job. Keep it up, fantastic work. Nice, we're coming up and get a squeeze and slowly release that bicep back down. Good job, fantastic. Keeping that tummy sucked in, nice strong core facing towards me. Lovely job, nearly there. Five to go, four, three, two, one. Okay, next one, we've got the step back lunge curl. So we're gonna step back, set ourselves, curl up and stand back up. Let's get ready to go in five, four, three, two, one. Step back, push off the front leg, come up and stand nice and tall. Focus on the balance, nicely done. Step back, set yourself, bicep curl, and stand tall. Nicely done, good, keep that going. Keep the head up facing forwards. Take it nice and slow and controlled. Think about the movement. Excellent work, there we go, good stuff. Three, two, one, perfect. Next one, front side raise. Or if you don't like that one, you can just do a front raise alternatively, just like that. Here we go in three, two, one, let's go. Out to the side, slowly down. Good job. Working the front of the shoulder, out to work into the middle of the shoulder. Nice, good, so we go front, middle, down. Excellent, well done. Halfway through, looking good. Standing nice and tall, facing towards me. Excellent work, keep it up. Five seconds to go, three, two, one. Lovely job, feet shoulder width apart, knees slightly bent. Let the arms lead down, lead up with the elbow, squeeze the lat and slowly release. Let's get ready, three, two, one, here we go. Keep the head facing down, keep a nice strong core, working those back muscles. Lovely job, excellent work, keep it up. Fantastic work, let's keep it up ladies and gentlemen, you're doing awesome. Perfect, squeeze, slowly back down. Up, one, two, down, one, two, good stuff. Here we go, three, two, one, nicely done. Arms by the sides with the weight, feet shoulder width apart, come up on the toes, squeeze the calves, and slowly back down. Okay, we're off in four, three, two, one, here we go, squeeze, slowly back down. Just like that, all had a little click on me then. <laughs> Nicely done, good stuff. Squeeze, working the calves in the back of the legs. Right at the bottom, there we go, good stuff. Nicely done. Keep that strong core posture, it's nice and upright, facing forwards. Good stuff, five seconds to go. Three, two, one, fantastic stuff. We're halfway through, so we've got two more rounds to go. You guys are doing awesome, let's keep it up. Feet shoulder width apart, weight on the heels, push up through the legs, extend the arms. Let's get ready in three, two, one, let's go. Keep a nice strong core, take your time, sitting back into that squat, push up through the legs. Nicely done, good effort. Round three is underway. Let's keep this going. Fantastic job. Nice. Good effort, head facing forwards. Nice strong core. And we've got some good clicky knees going on. <laughs> Three, two, one, awesome stuff. Hands by the side, palms facing in. Gonna come down to the side to the knee, squeeze the obliques, back up and over and squeeze again. Okay, three, two, one, down we go and squeeze. Up and over and squeeze. Just like that, fantastic work. Keep that going, good effort. Keep the tummy sucked in as always. A nice strong core. 
facing forwards. Good effort, fantastic work. Nice, keep it up. Come down and squeeze those obliques. Okay, three, two, one, nicely done. Palms facing in, knuckles facing out. Leading up with the elbows, weights underneath the chin, slowly back down. Work the biceps, shoulders, and trapezius. Three, two, one, let's go. Just like that, good. Get a nice strong base with the legs, with the feet shoulder width apart. Keep a nice strong core with the tummy sucked in. Lovely job, good. Halfway through, let's keep this going. Fantastic work. Keep it up. 10 seconds left, good job. Nicely done, that's perfect. Four, three, two, one. Lovely job. Next one's gonna be the hammer curl. Right hand to left chest, then left hand to right chest. As we come up, we're squeezing the biceps with a slow release. Let's get ready in three, two, one. Here we go. Just like that. Keep that nice strong core as well. Good base. Fantastic, good. Up and squeeze those biceps. Nicely done, good effort. Fantastic work everyone. Keep this up. Halfway through, looking good. Nice, okay, 10 seconds left. So let's get a couple more repetitions. Good, okay, four, three, two, one, perfect stuff. The next one we've got is the step back lunge with the bicep curl. Keeping that body upright, push off the front leg, come up and change, over. Let's get ready in four, three, two, one, let's go. Good stuff, keep the head up facing forwards. Squeeze the biceps as we bring the weights up. Good stuff. As we tread back, we're gonna focus on balance. Nice, good. Tummy sucked in with the strong core will also help with your balance. And just take your time. Lovely job, fantastic, well done, keep it going. Three, two, one. That is perfect, excellent. The next one we've got is the front side raise. Or well, again, you can do alternatively, just up and down. Let's get ready. And here we go. Nice, good stuff. Okay, work in the front of the shoulder, to the side of the shoulder, slowly back down. Nice, good stuff. Feeling the shoulders. Excellent, well done, keep it up. Halfway through. Good stuff, 10 to go. Nicely done, good job. Five to go. Good, three, two, one, excellent. Next one, bent over rows. Feet shoulder width apart, sticking the bum out. Knees slightly bent. Lead up with the elbows and slowly back down. Let's get ready. Three, two, one, here we go. Nicely done, good. Keep that nice strong core. Good stuff, and remember to control the weights. Don't let them drop. It's nice and slowly up and nice and slowly down. Good stuff, well done. Let's keep this going. Fantastic. Nicely done. Nearly there. Okay, three, two, one. Perfect stuff. Now we're gonna go on to calf raises. Feet shoulder width apart. Standing nice and tall, tummy sucked in. Raise up on your toes and slowly back down. Let's get ready in three, two, one, here we go, on the toes, slowly back down. Come up and squeeze those calves. Nicely done, good effort. Fantastic work. Keep this going, lovely job. Keep that strong core, facing forwards at all times. And just take your time throughout the exercise. Really think about the muscle that you're working. So that's the calf in the back of the leg. Really picture it in the head, three, two, one, fantastic work ladies and gentlemen. We've got one more round to go, so let's do this and finish nice and strong. Feet shoulder width apart, down for a squat and extending through. Let's get ready, three, two, 
one last round underway and extend through. Sit back into the squat, weight on the heels, push up through, standing nice and tall. Excellent stuff, well done. Keep that going. Fantastic work, take your time. Keeping the head facing forwards. Lovely job. Push up through. Excellent, so there's a lot of muscles working here. Keep that going, three, two, one. Nicely done, good, click your knees again. Okay, palms facing in. Gonna go down, squeeze the obliques, back over to the other side. Let's get ready in three, two, one. Good, as we go down now we squeeze, come up slowly and down slowly, squeeze. Perfect, good. Let's keep that going. Fantastic work. Good effort, take your time. If you can do one continuous movement, that's absolutely perfect, but you're more than welcome to stop at the top and go back down. Stop at the top and back down, good. Okay, three, two, one. Knuckles facing out, palms facing in, feet shoulder width apart, lead up with the elbows, squeeze at the top and slowly release. Let's get ready to go in five, four, three, two, and one, okay, off we go, fantastic, good. Good pace, good rhythm. Keeping the weights nice and slow and controlled. Up and squeeze, slowly release. Nicely done. Chin up, facing forwards. Fantastic work, 10 seconds to go. Let's get a couple more repetitions. Lovely job. Five, four, three, two, one, excellent. Next one's the hammer curl. Right hand to left chest, left hand to right chest. Let's get ready to go in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go up and squeeze, slowly back down. Good effort, nicely done. Perfect. So I'm bringing that right hand to left chest like that, and then changing over to the other side. Good job. And if in the future you wanna make this workout a little bit harder, just get heavier weights. If you wanna make it a little bit easier, use lighter weights or you can do it without weights. Okay, three, two, one. Excellent stuff. The next one we're gonna do is to step back, lunge into a bicep curl, push off the front leg, come up and change over. Let's get ready to go in four. There's three and two. And one, let's go. Nice, good. Take your time, don't forget. That's regardless if you're doing halfway or a quarter of a way, you take your time keeping that head up, facing forwards, a nice strong core. Good stuff, lovely job. Focus on balance. Excellent stuff, nice. Keep it up, fantastic work, nearly there. Three, two, one, perfect. Next one, front side raise. Well, again, you could do one after the other alternatively, just like that. We're going off in four, and three, and two, and one. Let's go, just like that, good. Up parallel to the ground, keep it parallel, gently down, nice, good. By doing this, we're keeping that shoulder under tension for a lot longer. So it's under tension, under tension, under tension, under tension, under tension, all the way there, and now it's off. So it's quite a long time for that muscle to be under tension. Okay, five, four, three, two, and one. Next one's bent over rows. Feet shoulder width apart, knees slightly bent. Lead the arms down, lead up with the elbows and squeeze, slowly back down. Let's get ready, final two exercises. Three, two, one, here we go. Just like that, good. Keep that nice strong core, head facing down as always. Lovely job. Fantastic. Come up and squeeze those lats in the back and slowly release. Lovely job, looking good. Keep that going, fantastic work. Nearly there. Up and squeeze, slowly back down. Three, two, 
one. Okay, we've got one more exercise left. So let's finish nice and strong. Well done for getting this far. Let's complete it with those calf races. Going up on the toes, slowly back down. In three, two, one. Here we go, up and down nice and slowly. Good. I nearly lost my balance there. I'm not going to lie. That would have been hilarious. <laughs> Nicely done. I've done it a lot of times where I've lost my balance and I've then cut it out. But next time, I promise you, if I lose my balance, I won't cut it out. I leave it in so you guys can have a good old laugh. Nicely done. Good. Up and squeeze them. Slowly back down. Let's do one more. Three, two, one. Excellent stuff. That is the workout completed. Well done. I'm going to stop my timer so it doesn't beep at me anymore. Excellent work. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that workout. So what we're going to do next is a full body cool down stretch standing. But if you need to hit the pause button, grab yourself a drink of water and then you can come back. Okay, so the first stretch that we're going to do, if you struggle with a bit of balance, I recommend you hold on to something quite solid. I'll demonstrate on the wall, then I'll demonstrate off the wall. So what we're going to do now is take the foot up just like this, keep the knees together, head up facing forwards, Keep a nice, strong core. Now, I get it, if you can't reach down to the foot, that's fine, it's a little trick. You see I'm wearing socks here, so if you're wearing trainers as well, grab it inside there. Now I'm not reaching down as far, I feel a lot more comfortable. So I'm just gonna swiftly move on to the side so you guys can see me. Excellent stuff. Keep the head up facing forwards. Stretch out the front of the leg, which is the set. Fantastic stuff, let's release that. Now, if you want to kill two birds with one stone and work on a bit of core stability, try this next one without holding on. So, I'm going to take the foot up just like this. Still only grabbing the sock, just to let you know. Keep the knees together, strong core, head up, facing forwards. Looking far into the distance, same as you drive a car. You look far down the road as far as possible. That helped me focus on my balance. There we go, good stuff. You may feel the leg that you're balancing on, Shake a little bit, that's okay, don't worry about that, that's just the core working. Nicely done. Okay, let's release that. Next one we'll do, both feet together just like this. Gonna have the right foot out, nice and straight, which forces the left leg to be slightly bent. Okay, hands on the bent leg, and then we're gonna push the bum back, and the hips back just like that, keep a nice strong core. Okay, excellent. Now on the straight leg, you can take the toes off the ground, and feel the stretch even more on the back of the leg, which is the hamstrings. Nicely done. I have no idea why my legs are shaking at the moment. <laughs> it's almost like I'm nervous, but I'm not. I just don't know why they're shaking. That's mad. Excellent stuff. Well done. Let's release that and change over. So I stay here. My left leg is going to go up nice and straight, which forces the right leg to be slightly bent. Hands on the bent leg. Sit back into it just like that. Take the toes off the ground. Good stuff. And now stretch out the back of the leg, which is the hamstring. Good stuff. Oh, my leg is really shaking. I don't know what's wrong with me. <laughs> okay, coming back to the middle end. Three, two, one. Okay, I'm glad that one's over with. Now we do some upper body stretches. Starting off with the shoulders. Take the arm across the chest. Other arm up through just like that. If that's too uncomfortable, I prefer this next way. Hand just slightly over and just gently put it across. Just like that. Well done. Keep that nice strong core going. And you can do this walking around your room or you can stay stationary on the spot. It's entirely up to you. I like to walk around because I'm quite fidgety. Nicely done. Good. Let's change over. Fantastic. Make sure the head is freely movable. It's not trapped in any kind of way. Lovely job. We're well, letting the blood flow back to those muscles. And a full body workout today. Awesome stuff. What a great way to start the day. Lovely job. Okay, next one. Take the arm up down between the blades and have the other arm here for support. Push that back. Feel the stretch in the tricep. Again, make sure the head is freely movable. Well done. Good effort. Nice, excellent. Let's change it over to the other side. Arm up, down between the blades. Support it with the other arm. 
Lovely job. And again, head has got to be freely movable, letting the blood flow back to the muscles. Fantastic release. Next one we're going to do, bring the hands up to head height, interlock the fingers, keep the elbows slightly bent, keep the hands at head height, drop the head down. Stretch out the upper back, which is the trapezius. Again, keep a nice straight back, a nice strong core. Excellent work. Fantastic stuff. Okay, slowly release that. Take the arms around the back, push out the chest. We'll stretch out the chest muscles. You can lift the arms out. Good stuff. Head up, facing forwards. Just like that. Fantastic work. Lovely job. Excellent. We're going to release that, come to the middle. We're going to drop the head down to the side and two fingers and we're just going to hold it in place. We're not putting any pressure on the head or the neck whatsoever. Just hold it in place and feel the nice little stretch going through the neck. Good little stretch. You've been working at the desk all day long to stretch out the neck. So imagine the head is always down facing forwards. Nice, good. Change it over to the other side. Lovely job, fantastic. Feel that nice little stretch here. Awesome work. Now we're going to finish off nice, slow, controlled nods up and down. Again, keep that nice and slow and controlled. We don't want any dizziness. Awesome work. Let's take it off to the sides. Fantastic job and we're back to the middle. Well done guys for completing that workout. I hope everybody enjoyed that workout. Please let me know how you got on just down in the comments below to say you enjoyed the workout. Even if you didn't enjoy the workout, let me know. Maybe I can make some changes next time to help everybody out. Anyway, if you're new here, hit the subscribe button. Absolutely free of charge, you pay no money whatsoever. Hit the bell notification that says all, oh, because every time I upload a workout or go live, you guys will get a lovely notification saying he's uploaded a workout. And um, if you're here as well, hit the thumbs up button. It helps the videos way more than you think. It really pushes out to people, and that's what I'm trying to do. Push it out to the um, over 50s group to get more people active and involved. And again, thank you so much for joining in today. Have a nice, a positive day, and be kind to each other. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.